we posted in my last video, lots of you guys asked how long it took for all my bigger colonies in this tank to get the size as they are right now today. And since I have a lot of Acropora frags in my grow system, they give me an idea to take pictures of my Acropora frags since I won't be cutting those anytime soon. And to give you an update for the next few months, every single month, just so you guys can have a visual idea of how long it takes for some of the Acropora frags to grow into a smaller colony. In these videos, I'm gonna make sure to give you an update on where my nitrates, phosphates are at, where pH is at, where my alkalinity is at. Just so you guys are running similar parameters in your system, you can kind of expect a similar growth for your Acroporas as well. And every single time I take photos from my frags, I'm gonna make sure to position my camera in the same spot every single time and to put my frags in my tank in the same distance. I'm gonna make sure to use the same lens, the same settings within my camera, just so you guys and I can have an ideal situation so I can follow the growth of my frags. Of course, not every situation is gonna be the same, not every tank is gonna be the same, but as I said, I'm gonna make sure to post all my parameters, hard values, and everything else, just so you guys can have the best idea of what you can expect from New York Acropora frags. Not all Acroporas are going to be the same, there's lots of different species within the Acropora family, which means not all of them will have the same growth rate. If you're a beginner, if you just set up your system and you got yourself a few Acropora frags, some are Acropora frags, even when we put them in a mature system, they take a while until they start picking up and start encrusting and growing. And especially their newer system. So if you just got into the hobby, I advise you to take your time and be patient. All my Acroporas are currently in the system that's been up and running for a few years now. And some of them I had for a few months, some of them I just caught. And here I decided to add some of my older frags with Acropora and some of the new as well. This video is gonna be pretty sweet and short, but after a few months, when we go over all the videos, all the posting on a monthly basis. We're gonna make one longer video where we can talk more about the best topic. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, and if you guys haven't checked out the tour of this tank that I've done last week, go and check it out. Since in that video I'm talking of everything what I'm using in this tank as far as filtration goes, what I'm dosing. So make sure to check that video out if you want to follow along. With all that out of the way, in exactly a month from now, see you guys in the next update.